It's Red Friday. Chiefs fans just two days away from kickoff at Arrowhead, so it's time to celebrate our Chiefs. Vendors across the metro, they're celebrating too. We're talking sandwiches named after players, red and gold jewelry. You don't have to look very far to see Chiefs pride is all over Kansas City. Well, Meshuggah Bagels is bringing back one of its popular products as well for opening weekend. Our Abby Dodge joining us live there from the bakery in Pleasant Valley. Uh, Abby, what do their Chiefs bagels look like? We got a glimpse of them earlier in our show, but we want to see them up close. Show us what you got. Yes, of course. Of course, Joe. These are red and gold twisted bagels and if you look at these right now they just came out of the boiler and if you come down follow me down this way they're about to put them all in the oven and to tell us a little bit more about these bagels i'm here with pete from mashiga bagels how are you doing this morning pete? Uh, really good good to be here <laughs> awesome why did you guys decide to bring back these red and gold bagels well it's gonna be a big year for the chiefs and uh, we're really excited about it we just wanted to show our support and celebrate that first home game and they're a little tougher to make than your average bagel. Can you describe that to me? Well, we need to split the dough into two halves and then basically make a red half and a gold half and then uh, twist them together, blend them just enough so that they get this uh, rainbow twisted look and uh, then treat them as a regular bagel. And how fast did these fly off of your shelves during the playoffs this year? Uh, we sold out by about 10 o'clock. Uh, the last time we did them, we have... Uh, pulled together a little larger quantity with about uh, 540 bagels this morning, so hopefully uh, supplies will last a little bit longer. And how many stores are you splitting those between? Uh, three. We've got Liberty, Power and Light, and 39th Street. Then we also have uh, them uh, stacked up and ready to go down to our Overland Park store as well. I appreciate it, Pete. Thank you so much. Yeah, and just good. a reminder, you can only get about half a dozen of these bagels, um, and they're going to stop you there because they have to have enough for the entire Chief's Kingdom. Coming up in the 6 o'clock hour, we're going to talk about some other local vendors that are supporting the Chiefs this season. Live in Pleasant Valley, Abby Dodge, KC TV 5 News. It is so fun to see just everybody getting on board with our Chiefs this season. We always have in Kansas City, but this season just feels a little extra special. Uh, so maybe bring us back some bagels to celebrate, Abby. I'm counting on it. It's 5.08 right now.